Alright, so episode 4 means one of those. And. Ding bong! There we go. Welcome back to episode 4, everyone, um, of this Minecraft Let's Play. Um, as you can see, this is very different um, from what it was last time. Um, if you didn't remember what it looked like before, feel free to check out the other ones on the channel. You know what? I'm tired for always having to go down there, risking my butt, and getting iron. So, what I'm gonna do instead is, I'm going to build an iron farm. That's right, a farm made of iron. Jokes is a farm to produce iron, and I know the perfect place to make it. It needs to be far enough away so that it doesn't interfere with my village that I do plan on having at some point. The choices are, I can either have the iron farm close to my house, and so then therefore, I will have access to iron, or I can make the village a trading post far away, so that it would just take me a long time to just go and trade. I'm going to capture two villages, and we will build them some beds, and then we'll go from there. A bit further away than here. Oh, there's a copper thing from last time. Just one random island. This is where we're gonna um, recruit, recruit our new villagers. Hello. Wake up, sir. Mine. So, as you can see, I've just placed a boat. And two of them jumped in. Then I jump in. Oh no, that is not the way to go. No, don't do it. No. Ha! And we did it. Oh no, oh, it's coming night time. Okay. Uh, where are you going? Where are you going? Yes. Yes. Who's that? Oh. No, stay away from him. Oh no! What happened? Ah! Ah! Ow, 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 ow. Now's not the time. No! No! Ah! Yes. Oh. Alright. I don't need this. Alright, I've said it once, and I'll say it again. Who would like to come on a magical journey to a nice place that's better than this? No cats? You look like someone good. Alrighty then. Only are people ignoring me in real life, but also in this game. A sword! Chump. Alright, let's do this. <gasps> He's still alive! How? You're still alive! That's awesome! That's your bed. Torch. Go. I don't want to have to do this again. Come on. Just. No. Ah.
we're going for an artistic theme here, i.e. all my blocks are down there and I thought I would have enough. Come on, it's nice up here. Come on. Uh. <laughs> no. Come in. Come in. Come in. I have bread. Do you want bread? Are you negotiating on how much bread you want? Go up, please. Oh, there we go. Okay. I think we might need more than a hundred. That's it? Nothing. Yes. Hey, there we go. We made one. Yay! Cool. Finally! Oh my gosh. Oh! How did you get out? How did you get out? Yeah, go run off then. Did you... I have so many questions. <laughs> so, it's clear that this works. This... Okay, awesome. We have successfully completed a iron farm, everyone. And once I clear up these couple of blocks, I think we are going to call that an end of episode. Um, just ignore, just ignore the rest of this mess. I will try and fix it next time. Okay, so this is post-editing me. Um, I just realized that I forgot to explain how this whole concept actually works. So, for some reason it needs to be a certain amount of blocks. I believe it's eight blocks above the ground in order to work. Um, you can build one below ground, but I just decided to follow the tutorial uh, exactly as I was told. Um, and the beds need to be arranged in this order with five villages and five beds. Um, and, as you can see, 
Above here is what we, is the kill chamber. There's a bucket of water that's pushing it, uh, pushing the iron golem that spawns because of the villagers below into this lava, killing it. The signs hold it in place. We've got three hoppers in the corner, right underneath where the kill chamber is, and then they fall into this chest. Now later on, I might decide to um, have like a little redstone sort of thing where I can have that little composter thing that we have back at home um, to make it into bone meal so then you have a bone meal farm slash iron farm both in one because it's going to do it anyway the only problem with having it this far away is that you need to be within proximity and sometimes you might need an afk just to have like a lot of iron golem spawn just because it won't do it on its own because it's quite far away from me so that's just one of the drawbacks that you have so it's sometimes good just to put like a little bed there sleep etc so yeah Back to the regular scheduled content. Alrighty, have a good one. See ya. Bye.